What's up, guys? Proof here, bringing you a pub gameplay. This is uh, a <coughs> hard point on hijacked, and I absolutely go off. So, uh, pretty much gonna talk about my team and what's been going on. Um, we haven't been scrimming much, and uh, one thing, the reason why it bothers me, and I don't want to sound like like I'm complaining at all. I don't want it to come off like that, but it's just like. When me and Rambo put so much time in and, like, you know, want to better ourselves, want to play better, and, you know, with the game, you know, being on the circuit, we just feel like our team should be as motivated as us to want to play more. Um, you know, I don't know if you guys ever had this happen to you, whether it's basketball, whether any sports that you play, but, like, when you give so much effort into something and you feel like you've done all that you can do to, you know, make yourself, you know, perform and be at your highest level you possibly can be and then come up short due to people, you know, not wanting to play as much as you and, you know, take it as serious as you do, it, it bothers you, you know, you want to, you want to be able to, you know, see results for what you've done, you know, you've, you've played so much, you've put in so much time, and when you fall short, just, you know, it's, it's not a good feeling, you just want to, you just want to be the best that you can be, and, you know, if your teammates played as much as you and, you know, put, put as much effort as you did, it would just be so much better, but, um, you know, it's, we, we hopefully, we still got a lot of time. You know, the event isn't until March, so, you know, not by any means am, am I saying, oh, man, this is, we're looking really bad for this event. We still have a lot of time, and pretty much I'm just hoping, you know, we all start playing more, and we start playing more as a team. We all start playing more as a team, you know, taking it serious and taking our game to the next level, so that way we can see very, very positive results. Um, but, yeah, so in this gameplay, I'm absolutely going off using the MSMC. I uh, can't really remember my attachments, but I'm just... Going on a rampage right now. I hate knifing on this game. It's terrible. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I, dude, I've choked so many kills from knifing. I don't know about you guys. You can leave comments about that, but I think the knifing's terrible. So, I mean, every now and then I'll get, I'll get some good knife kills. Pick up a, pick up a beastly, like, two piece. I actually can't wait for the montage to drop. I got a really sexy knife feed in there you guys might like. So, um, but yeah. So, once we start, I mean, we played, we scrimmed, uh, maybe for about three hours the other day, and we didn't drop a map, but just imagine if we played as much as other teams who, you know, have won tournaments, for example, you know, Complexity winning Frag Cup, everyone knows how much they, how much time they put into it prior to, you know, they played a lot, they grind it, they deserved that win, you know, I'm not taking anything away from them, they deserved it, uh, they were my team that I predicted to win that event, so, you know, I'm... It's good that they, you know, put all the effort that they have to, to, you know, be successful. So, you know, I like I like that they actually, you know, saw results. So, just goes to show what playing and what practice can do for a team. You practice how you play. They were dominating in scrims prior to the tournament. Went into the tournament, and they ended up getting the W. So, yeah, so I, that's where I want to be. I want to be how complexity was. I want to be able to play that much. I want to be able to constantly just, you know, grind, 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 grind until, you know, we feel like we are the, you know, a competing team to, you know, more than likely take first place. So, I mean, right now we definitely on paper have a roster to do so. Now, if we put in the time, you know, you guys could see us winning a lot of events this year. But, you know, I hate making roster changes. Um, you know, unfortunately, if we don't start playing more, you know, things will have to happen. But, you know, I don't want that to happen. I want to be able to play with the team I have now and just take everything 100, 110% serious and perform. So, yeah. Um, what's been, and I'm going to talk about what's been going on with me. Um, I've been pretty much busy working on a lot of outside projects, still gaming related. I uh, can't talk about it too much, but just, you know, I've been trying to dip my hand in any kind of business I can, you know, get opportunities for myself as well as my team. So being the captain, I want to feel like I can, you know, contribute to the team and take that next step, you know, making moves and uh, being a businessman. I mean, I am 20 and I want to get more involved in the business X aspect of gaming. So, you know, it's a, it's a learning for me. Um, so I'm still learning, I'm still learning a lot about how, how it works and all, but I just want to just want to be able to, to, you know, step up as this captain role and take initiative on getting things done for the team. Uh, as far as content goes for the team channel, um, you know, we got our montage coming out. 
Uh, I, we actually, you know, me and Rambo were able to pick up an editor together. Rambo does help a lot with the, the leadership aspect of the team. He has had a ton more experience than me, and I do take his advice and what he tells me. So, you know, he's helping me become more mature, more of a more of a leader rather than just a player. And that's one thing, you know, I do I do like about him is he brings out the best in a lot of players. So, you know, with him on my team, you know, I could probably become a way better player than I, you know, I am right now I, just because of his knowledge. Um, you know, you saw Rambo in MW3 or or Blobs 1 just being able to teach his team how to play and taking them to that next level of gaming. So, you know, I hope that will be the case with me and him. I hope we do become a very strong duo in this game. I don't see me and him being on separate teams for, you know, for a while, guys. I'm going to be honest with you. I see me team with Rambo for, for a while. Um, so, yeah. That's my that's my thoughts on what my team on the team situation, where we're at, how I feel about my leadership, um, what I what my plans are. So yeah, um, my what what I expect from this roster. I have high expectations, being the kind of person that I am. Um, I, I like to you know I don't like no one likes losing. Um, you know you like being the best that you possibly can be at any game. You know, so I want I want to place top four every event this year and the reason why I set that goal is because with a goal like that you know it really just you know that's my goal and it makes me that much more um, into wanting to be the best that I can be when I set goals that are attainable but very hard to reach it makes me as a person work you know a million times harder just to achieve that goal um, Rambo's the same way, and that's another thing I admire about him is we we both share the same goals and views on things as far as gaming goes. I want to be doing this like even when I'm done playing professionally, I want to be able to you know still be involved with this community. I love this community, and you know I like I love you guys. You guys treat me so well and show me great support. So I just want to continue to be around and be involved in this environment. It's a lot of positive energy from you guys, and it's always awesome to see that. You know, pretty much, you know, in my comms, you guys give me advice about how I should do this or how I should do that. Um, what you guys think about my comms, um, what comms you want to see. All of that really, you guys, I try to comment on every comment I see. And, you know, I don't know if I tell you guys enough, but, you know, I really do appreciate it. Like, I'm th like I don't think I'm hot shit. I don't think I'm, like, you know, the man or anything. And I feel like everyone has room for improvement. And you know, a lot of people don't cherry, a lot of people don't give you guys or choose to listen to your advice as much as I do. So you know, I'm I'm very thankful that you guys are so open with me. And, you know, being honest, I could take criticism. It doesn't affect me. I just want to do what you guys like to see. I know you can't be a people pleaser. You can't make everyone happy. But you know, I, I like to try. So again, thank you guys for you know all this continued support. My channel is growing so fast. I couldn't be happier. Um, so yeah, thank you guys. I really do appreciate that. <clears throat> But, you know, back to this comm, I'm dominating right now. I, I think I, uh, I don't know what I am right now, but I'm on a huge spree, as you guys can just see me tearing it up right now. Uh, I'm going to have to get a live gameplay like this, though, like, just, uh, just, like, as I'm playing. Just maybe do a listening kind of thing, but not really a team listening, just listening on me as I'm playing this game, so. So you can hear how, how hype I get when I get kills. Whenever I get, like, a, a huge feed, I'm just like, ah! I'm like, oh my god, get dominated! But, um... <laughs> Who doesn't, you know? When you get when you get crazy sick feeds, it definitely brings some energy to you. You do get uh pumped up, so get a get a huge lag spike here. Actually my game was cut short. I do end up going one hundred twelve and twelve. Didn't notice that the host migrated, but um I hope you guys do enjoy this gameplay. I do know that I finished one hundred and twelve and twelve. Sorry that you couldn't see the last kills there, but I hope you do enjoy the gameplay and this is proof I'm out. Peace.